Hey guys, my name is Insane. This is my second tutorial looking uh, after how to do stuff in uh, Source SDKs, Face Boozer. So, uh, again, you will need to have original game from uh, the Source core list. It's like Construct Source, Team Fortress 2, Half Life 2, etc. Okay, so start as Source SDK. It's located in, in Tools in Steam. And uh, we'll use engine version Half Life 2 Episode 1 and current game Half Life 2. Uh, and start face poser. Okay, this is uh, this is uh, most likely tutorial for Windows Vista and Windows 7 because I use Windows 7 uh, personally and I think it's good. Uh, but I will show you way that you can also use in Windows XP. Uh, but th this way I prefer more. Okay, so uh, choose choreography and new. I will call call it Pyro is Pyro is a penis. Actor's name Pyro probably. Okay. Um. So you will uh, need to load your sound. Uh, your sound has to be wave. Um. Give me a second. I will start up my Audacity. Uh, because you need to use uh, exact uh, type of wave file. Uh, my this sound is that pyro is a pe that pyro is a penis, and so open out the city, click on edit and preferences, and on in the quality tab, default sam sample rate must be uh, forty four thousand kilohertz. 44,000 Hertz and file format must be WAVE Microsoft 16-bit PCM nothing else 16-bit PCM uh, click OK and extract as wall file and extract to uh, Steam, Steam Apps, uh, Half-Life 2 your, your username Half-Life 2, Half-Life 2 and sound I will call it uh, Pyro is penis okay so open your uh, source SDK face poser, click on load and there will be your sound, pyro is penis. Oh, when you have Windows 7 or most likely Windows Vista and you click on re-extract uh, you must uh, type exact phrase what was it? that pyro is a penis Okay, uh, most likely this will go wrong, and you will see the red uh, red font uh, saying the last extraction result was a fail, complete failure and error. Okay, uh, so uh, you must use uh, my preferred way of uh, of editing the lip syncing, and it's called uh, Phenom. You must uh, edit uh, exact phenoms for for the current word. So, if you had that, okay, I will slow down it and select just this. Okay, so uh, I will s select just that, and it's a little bit shorter, I think. Okay, uh, I think it's good. So, click on the selected word and select Add Phenom. Oh gosh, just have to move a little bit down. Uh, add Phenom to that, and you know what what's going on? That it's like that. So, um, it's the where's A? Oh my god, this freaks me out all the time. And T. Okay. Okay, uh, so I will uh, add Phenom to Pyro. It's Pi. Uh, 
Okay, uh, you can see the lip syncing is very good because uh, you do it your way and you can edit uh, exact phenome. For example, when you when you think this is bad, you just click on edit and you choose another phenome. It's it's this is the best way for me because uh, for example if you know um, Ross God and his series um, Civil Protection from Half-Life 2 it's he's using this way and you can sure it's a hell lot a lot, a hell lot more fun than uh, than the XP way okay so I think is is here and it's a little bit shorter is also a little bit shorter and is is a little bit shorter and a okay I think now it's good so I will just edit is add phenom to is and it's uh, is N gosh mm. okay I think it's good so uh, when you're done, you just uh, okay. One one thing uh, when you when you when you're going to match uh, the correct uh, uh, timing to the word, uh, you have to select the word and click on Control and drag a mouse. You will see a little double arrow here, and you just drag it with mouse. It's very useful when you are doing exact. Uh, exact uh, lip syncing like Ross God, not me. And in real time, it's give me a credit. I think it's good. Okay, um, so uh, this was tutorial how to how to import the sound to um, to face poser and don't forget to save your choreography and. Uh, in the next tutorial I will show you how to do this for Team Fortress 2 and I will show you how to do uh, a seed in Team, in Team Fortress 2 game and in Gary's mod. Okay, so thanks for watching, this was insane, um, I'm out.